everyone, I'm Kiki. Welcome back or welcome to my channel. Today I have an Hermes unboxing to share with all of you. So if you're interested in all that, please keep watching. Let's get started. Ding ding. All right, so to start off, I have my usual. I've already unboxed it and maybe I'll include a clip of me unboxing the giant box that held this. Um, this should be the receipt, but let me just double check. I always order when I order from Hermes.com because this is an online order. I always ask for a blank card. I love to have these. It's always just, you know, you're already paying so much. You might as well have a nice free card. You can use them as um, gift card, thank you cards or whatever in the future. So it's always nice to have. There's that. Um, this is usually the receipt. Yes, so this is the return policy, etc., etc. And over here is the receipt, but I'm not going to show you that. Oh, I've never had this before. Interesting, I've never received this bag before, I guess because I've never actually purchased technically a bag from Hermes, though. Oh, that's interesting. Not that, I'm sorry, not that I've not ordered a bag from Hermes. I have not purchased a bag from Hermes directly from the online store. I bought from the boutique, but not online. I wonder if this is a new thing. Have you guys noticed ribbon this thick? Like it's super thick. The normal ribbon's like half the width of this. It's really nice. I actually really like this, this ribbon. It's more substantial. It feels a little bit different, I guess, than the normal ribbon, or maybe it's just because it looks it's just on a larger scale. But all right, here we go. Here is the box. It's pretty big. Any guesses as to what it is? <laughs> do, 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 Welcome to Kiki's channel. Do, do. Ding, ding. So, without further ado, let's get started. So last chance, what do you guys think is in this bag? Here I go. I'm excited. You don't know what it is. Yeah. Ta-da. <laughs> I'm actually super surprised this came in a box and a dust bag because for those of you who know, this is actually the Hermes grooming bag and technically it's under the equestrian section of Hermes. Oh my gosh, it's a lot nicer than I thought it was going to be. I don't know, not that I thought that the quality was going to be bad, but um, yeah, it feels a lot nicer and smoother. Wow, it is really nice. Moompa, excuse me. Yeah, you can come over here. Um, anyway, so like I was saying, it's in the technically in the equestrian section of um, the Hermes website. So usually in the equestrian section, I don't think they come in boxes. Correct me if I'm wrong, because I think I've um, seen online some people who ordered this bags, uh, this bag from different countries did not receive the dust bag so and the box. So um, maybe it just depends on the country that you're ordering it from. But here, I'm gonna show you guys the bag. Here's the front side. And the front again with Hermes Cellier on the front. It's made of canvas, 100% um, canvas. And here's the stuffing. Whoa. Ooh. Oh my gosh, I love how Hermes always does this. 
Because you know what, some brands I feel like it's a hit and miss with Louis Vuitton, you don't always have them, it depends on who you get, your sales associate, you don't always have them put the strap inside a dust bag, which I think you always should just because if you're traveling with it or just the fact that you're paying the amount of money that you're paying for a bag, doesn't it make sense that they, they include something like this? So, yeah. Here is the strap. And it is non-adjustable for those of you who are curious. It is simply a kind of like a guitar strap type thing. I'm gonna show you guys as usual. Made in France. You know I am biased, but I love that. Made in France. Oh my gosh, the quality of this is really nice. Like I know I keep saying this, but you guys have to feel it to know. I don't think it's really it's it's not doing a good job. Um just on camera, even though I'm trying my best. I feel like once you feel it, you'll, you'll understand what I mean. It feels substantial and it feels luxurious, more so than a um, canvas or whatever this material is strap should be, if that makes sense, or at least nicer than the ones I felt in the past. So definitely if I were to compare it to how my Louis Vuitton or Coach strap feels, this feels much more luxurious, much more luxe. It's very thickly knit, densely knit. It's really nice. So as some of you guys know, this was actually on my wish list um, for, what was it? My 2023 wish list, which was the first wish list video that I've ever made. Um, and to be honest, I don't really do wish lists. I just kind of have things floating in my head that I know I want and will eventually get maybe, but that list is always changing. I mean, taste change, plans change. And when you add something to your collection, it sometimes makes you change your mind about what you want, right, kind of thing. I hope that makes sense. But anyways, um, this was actually on my list. The one in gray, I think, is the one that I put in the video because this comes in two different colors. This comes in a gray color scheme made out of 100% wool felt or this navy blue version that is made out of cotton canvas. And I was okay with either one. At the beginning, I was leaning more towards um, gray because it's more neutral and it's definitely something that I, I would normally have in my wardrobe. I don't really have a lot of navy blue, but I don't know. I've, I've recently wanted to add the, remember that dust bag bag that I bought? Um, the Hermes A-Line bag? I've wanted to buy it in navy, but of course the moment I wanted to buy it, it's off the online website. So I missed that boat, but if it comes back on again, okay, so I'll just grab it. Um, so I've been looking online for this bag. I tried to grab it a couple, I think a month or two ago, and I had added it to my car. I did make the order, and again, it did not go through. I have no idea why Hermes keeps doing this to me, but um, finally, I saw it, I think, a couple days ago, maybe not even a week ago, online, and I was just like, what? What the heck, man? And so I just added it to my car like, as quickly as I could, and yeah, now I have it, yay! And I had considered getting the dog bag, too. So I just want to, I'm probably going to do, sorry, I'm kind of rushing through this. Um, I'm going to do probably an in-depth what fits in my bag and like showing you guys um, the bag in another video since this is going to probably already run a little long. But I just wanted to show you guys that my little guy here ho, 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 can fit inside. For those of you who are thinking of using it as a dog bag, I don't know who's thinking of that, but I mean, other than me. Ta-da! He fits and you can't even see him! He's perfectly fitting! Here. Okay, yeah. He fits so well that, um... Oh my god, this is actually really nice for him. Right? Is this terrible? Terrible? Or wonderful? Oh, there's one cheese. So let me know what you guys think and if you guys want me to do a thorough review, which I'm gonna do anyway, but if you have any questions about the bag specifically, what parts you want me to show you guys, I'd love to do that. I, um, I'm gonna do, I guess, a what fits in my bag, clearly dogs, um, or a, this dog. Um, what else am I gonna do? Just that kind of thing. Yeah, what fits in my bag, 
how much it costs, blah, 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 in another video. I just wanted to do a quick unboxing to share with all of you since I was super excited and could not wait to unbox it. And I actually have a ton of other unboxings to share with you that I've already recorded, but because, you know, um, my, my bunny Buru died recently, I just haven't, I haven't been able to get the energy. And today, I don't know what was wrong with me or what, what's, what's gone right with me, I should say. I've had a little bit more energy, like just, just like a little jolt. Maybe it's my, my green tea. Um, so I had the energy to film this right now and I'm hoping that my mood doesn't go back down again and I'm able to film some more for you guys since it's so fun for me to do and I love interacting with you guys. So yeah, let me know if you have any suggestions for future videos. I hope you enjoyed this video. It was super fun for me to make, obviously. <laughs> and I'll catch you guys next time. Bye bye. Oh wait, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to hit the bell button to be notified whenever I upload new videos. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye. Jenny. Ding ding. Do 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 do. Thanks for watching. Come again. Bye bye.